Alrighty guys, so I did a video about hood sight about four weeks ago in the time of this video and the video did actually in fact did pretty well and actually now I was stumbling around the comment section right and I actually came across this comment that said that hood sight has returned and this is where it sparked this video idea. So I did a little Google research just to make sure and yes, it is in fact true. What's up everybody, I'm Amarks and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be discussing and going on the website of Hoodsite to see the possible changes it has happened, you know, to make the domain and the website possible again. And to all the newcomers watching this video, if you ever wondered what happened to Hoodsite in the first place, I did make an original Hoodsite video which will be in the description down below. So therefore, let's get on to it. Now obviously with every website getting taken down, chances are most of the content and everything will be removed and so in fact that the domain probably got renamed. So instead of Hoodsite, Hoodsite.com is now called Hoodsite.info. So when we go on the homepage, you'll see that, well, the website is pretty bland and outdate looking so far. Well, that's because literally by the time of this video is being recorded that this thing literally got put back up on a new domain. And it's actually pretty impressive how much they have gotten done in just a short period of time. So as of right now on the homepage, you'll see that the website has in fact videos, but it's not the usual gory videos that people are expecting. On these videos so far, you'll see that each video has every uh, new source of every crime or hate crime incident that is currently going on in the world right now or across the country and of course in other countries as well. Now the explanation is actually pretty simple like it's literally just a brand new website and they're organizing all the crimes and incidents with every news source and whatnot just to get the or uncensored content ready. Therefore obviously it's not fully ready yet and of course with all the backlash and controversy it's gotten to like I wouldn't go on a website right away such as uh, Hood Site which is super controversial after getting my stuff removed like I'm pretty sure they're just taking baby steps so no it wouldn't get caught on over under the radar again and stuff like that and yeah it, it, it could be really slick and very smooth process and transition so when we go on the about page you'll see there's a bunch of unweird letter coding and stuff HTML related mainly for people who are into coding and stuff this is also a proof of concept and explanation of course like I said it's still in development but it's still being updated while we're probably speaking and talking of course in a matter of weeks and months obviously this thing will probably get a lot better because all that lost work man it's that could be such a pain and eventually they'll start uploading videos on their own domain because you know how much money it will cost to get like a website such as hood site and all that a video sharing site as big as it was to host all those videos again I know uh, I've done a little bit of website coding myself and back when I was younger and yeah, it does not cost, it costs a lot of money just trying to get uh, MP4 files and all different video types of support and play on a website. That's not just through a YouTube HTML embedded coding stuff. As what I said in the last video about Hoodsite is uh, I don't support like the crimes and stuff people upload and post of like personal family members and stuff. But this is a good website for a good eye opener reality again and I'm of course I'm open to like freedom of speech and all that and obviously it's not really like a bad thing in terms of like the content itself. It's more like a morbid curiosity thing like I said in the last video too. I don't want to repeat myself too much because I think I'll be just remaking the same video if I were but I'm not going to go into more into detail with that. But it, yeah, like I said, uh, this is more like a beta or like a, you know, a baby step forward to the transition onto the new, new domain of hood site. And it's actually pretty exciting to see. And I hope like, I hope the internet and censorship doesn't take over with this website again, because there's obviously other ones too that hasn't been caught yet that I could maybe do videos on in the future. Another thing I'd like to say too, is when you see like the hood site name title on the top of the page, it does say uncensored uh, gore and videos and content. That's actually also a proof of concept of them getting back into to the groove too that's more of like more proof and evidence so yeah it's gonna be pretty interesting and I've, like i said they better keep this up because man all these morbid curiosity people and fans man they have every right to look at this stuff like i said and yeah i'm sorry to keep this video short but this is all pretty much what i have to say about the whole website of uh, hood site being back right now there's no new updated and information about the owners or anything because this was more like a community built channel or video i mean website i'm sorry for a uh, hood site and i do think that this will get way bigger of course and let's hope this time like i said uh it won't get recognized 
So anyways, everybody, thank you for watching this very, very short video, but I hope it's very to the point and direct with you guys about what has happened with the website hood site. And I hope you guys stick around for my new future content. I also very thankful for you, thankful for you guys that I got 2,500 subscribers in just a matter of a couple months. That's actually a big milestone for my channel because it took me about over a year and a half just to go from 1,000 to 2,000 subscribers. And man, I couldn't be any more grateful. And thank you for the guys uh, sticking around, watching any other content I make too that's not just about these websites because you guys are greatly appreciated. Like I said, if there's any new content that comes out with this website, I'd be more than happy to make it because hood site's a pretty good topic to talk about. And yeah, I'll probably see you guys next time. So, if you guys like today's video, make sure to leave a like. If you really enjoyed the content, make sure to hit subscribe. And yeah, just kind of feel free to keep me up with this website and I will be gladly making more videos. So, I will see you guys next time.